DIY back to school kind of thing for you guys. So I hope you guys like it. So I'm going to teach you guys how to make this really cute notebook. It's a composition notebook and um, it looked really, really plain and old when I first had it. So I just jazzed it up and I'm going to show you guys how to make the back of it. And it's really easy. There are so many tutorials out there, but I wanted to make my own original one. So you're going to need a composition notebook or spiral notebook. And here's the back of my notebook just to see what we're going to work on. A pencil, some Tumblr photos or pictures, whatever you want. And I decided to also print out a Marilyn Monroe picture just as a base. So you're going to take your notebook, some scissors, pencils, and a glue. And start cutting out your base photo. So once you're done cutting it, you're going to begin to glue it and make sure to arrange it the way that you want to. I decided to put mine in the middle, but you can put yours on the side, on the left, right, top, down, whatever you want. So once I'm done gluing, I'm going to glue it all down and make sure that it's nice on there and that it stays because those will stick off if you do not have a good quality glue. Now make sure to glue whatever you forgot to glue on because I'm clumsy like that and I will forget. So once I'm done, I smooth it down and I begin to pick out what pictures I want to use. I printed out a bunch of colored photos and yeah. And some black and white photos. So if you want to use a black and white theme, more than happy to. And try to make sure to do smaller ones if you have a really big picture in the middle. So yeah. So once you're done, you want to take a picture of it just as a reference so you don't forget what it looks like once you have to move all that stuff off. And that's what I did. And you can just have it right beside you while you're gluing everything down. So that's what it looks like once I'm finished gluing it. And it's very cute to me. So I left it on my windowsill. It was kind of a hot day. And I let it dry. And my dumb self didn't leave the window open for it to dry a little quicker. So once it's done drying, you just want to cut off all the little edges onto it and just turn the book open so that you can actually see compared to the white of the book around. And if you have a composition notebook, the ends will be kind of curved, so watch out for that. So once I'm done with that, that's what it looks like. And I make sure to glue down any extra flyaway pieces that I've forgotten because I will. Then I'm going to take my homemade Mod Podge glue, which you can buy at the craft store but I'm just too lazy and I can't get it and I put it all over my picture it comes out white at first but once it dries it comes out matted or you can buy a glossy kind so that's what it looks like at the end and yeah okay. it was that easy you guys I hope you guys like this tumblr inspired school notebook kind of video you know there's a whole bunch of them but I want to add my own sizzle to it and I have so many other videos for you guys Thumbs up if you like my video.